Here's a question. Do you guys look different from your friends? Definitely. Yeah. Yeah? You look different from your friends? Why? Why do you not cut your hair? Because that's what Guru Nanak Dev Ji and Guru Gobind Singh Ji told us. So what I would always say was, I don't look different. I look how we should look. Yes. Why do you look different? If your all of your friends they they decide that they will be the way God made them, do you think that their hair will grow? If it, they, if they it will grow. Definitely. So why will they grow? Because that is how human body is made by God. So the idea is the way God has made you, He's made you that way for a reason. Whether it's in the fantasy world, whether it's in the anime world, whether it's in your natural human world, you stay how God has created you. अटैच कर कोशिश कर रहे हैं और मेरी ये कोशिश है कि आप बिल्कुल जमीनी पद्धर तो लैके और बच्चों सारे क्वेश्चन से आंसर उपलब्ध करवाईए जेडे उन्होंने अक्सर उन्होंने स्कूल के उन्होंने सोसायटी उन्होंने फ्रेंड सर्कल के पुछे जा सकते हैं पिछला जो असी एपीसोड किया डिस्कस किया बच्चों के नाल कि सिख कौन है एक बड़ी बेसिक डैफीनेशन और कोशिश की कि बच्चों जो एक कलीशेड डैफीनेशन दिखती जाती है कि सिख का मतलब स्टूडेंट हों सीखण वाले का मतलब सिख हों क्ड के उन्होंने जी करैक्ट डैफीनेशन आल लैके जाया जाए सो अज का जो एपीसोड है वो उस ही एपीसोड की कंटीन्यूटी है पर अज अपना जो सवाल है वो असं एक डिफरेंट सवाल के नाल आवेंगे बच्चों नवे क्वेश्चन का जोड़ा आंसर देन की उन्होंने डिस्कस करके उन्होंने इंबाइव करने की कोशिश करा इट्स डेफिनेटली इंपोर्टेंट संगत जी वन एवर वी टोक अबाउट मीनो टीचिंग आर चिल्ड्रन अबाउट मीनो वॉट द फ्यूचर इज वॉट सीख हिस्टरी इज वॉट सीख इतिहास इज यू नो वॉट सीख इजम इज इन जनरल इट्स वेरी वेरी इंपोर्टेंट वी हैव अ लॉ ऑफ मिसकनसैप्शन नाउ अ डेज We have a lot of problems with teaching our youngsters. You know what Sikhism actually teaches them about. Unfortunately, um, in schools, in colleges, you know, in higher level, um, the way in which Sikhism is explained uh, is very different to what it actually is. It's very distorted. Um, so it's important that we try and provide our um, children, our youngsters, with correct definitions, with correct ideology, so that they can grow up and then become. um you know good seeks in themselves and be confident in answering questions that they will encounter um you know a lot of people will say that you know nowadays children aren't asked questions i'm still being asked questions and i'm in university so it's important that our youngsters are taught the answers to questions about sikhism um in a correct way in the last episode obviously we discussed what is a sikh who is a sikh the definition of a sikh um and uh, you know we will definitely recap that as well uh, in the coming episode however today our topic will be different our question will be different so today we are going to start this episode again from the same point we'll be asking them uh, the name of gurus in a particular order in a specific order and uh, we request you all sitting at home to do the same because that is very important our children should know that what is the name of their gurus but in an appropriate in a correct order and that is very important majority of our children rather if i'll say that majority of the young people uh, that that'll not be wrong to not know that what is the correct order of the names so um shall i start with you start with him uh, you first introduce yourself to sangat ji um mera naam bruno singh hai meri umar um 9 saal di hai mera shehar barmangam hai Hari do you want to introduce yourself Yeah Go on Mera naam hai Sanjay Maria Umar Chetal di hai Good And today we will start from with Hari Um Hari can you uh, can you tell us the names of 10 gurus Nanak Dev ji Guru Angad Dev ji Guru Amar Das ji Guru Ram Das ji Guru Ajay Dev ji 
Oh, very good. And now your turn. Um, Guru Nanak Dev Ji, Guru Angad Dev Ji, Guru Amadas Ji, um, Guru Ram Das Ji, Guru Arjun Dev Ji, Guru Har Gobind Sahib Ji, Guru, um, Guru Har Rai Ji, Guru Har Krishan Ji, Guru Teg Bahadur Ji, Guru Gobind Singh Ji, Guru, um, Grand Sahib Ji, Guru Khalsa Pant Ji. And that's, that's brilliant. So this is the correct order. Our children should know the names of ten gurus in this order. And who is our eternal guru? Um, guru, um, guru Granth Sahib Ji. Uh, do you remember, Hari, do you remember what we did last time? We discussed something and it was? Say. Who is it? It's Sikh. Good. Okay, so Hari, who is a Sikh? Okay, right. What was the What was the definition we told you? We have the thoughts five, but we believe in ten gurus and guru. Mhm. And Guru Granth Sahib Ji. Very good. Very good. And there was one thing more. Bruno, what was the other thing we talked about? Um, hmm? um uh, a person who is truthful living. Okay. Yes. And and if I say, what is truthful living then? Mean. Yeah? Uh, it uh, means God. Mm -hmm. Okay. It means? Uh, that you live in love. Good. Mm -hmm. Very good. And? Something about teamwork, about saving people. About saving people, that is kindness, of course. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. So all those, all those traits, all those uh, you know attributes which, which we think God possesses. So here's the question today. Why, uh, if we talk about your friends, mm. yeah, you, I'm sure you guys have friends, right? You're not lonely, yes. like me, are you? Right? Yes. Yeah, you have friends. Okay, yeah. that's good. Right? So, here's a question. Do you guys look different from your friends? Definitely. Yeah. Yeah? Do you look different from your friends? Why? Um, uh, some of them have short heads and we don't. Okay. What else? They don't cover their heads and we do. Mm -hmm. Good. How do you worry about you? They are not Sikhs. They're not Sikhs. And right. we are. Okay. Yeah. Right? So, why do you look different then? So this wha what's the reason behind yes, it? Yes, this is how do you look different because yeah. they they have short hair, you don't. So why do you think is that? Um, because they don't follow the same religion as us. Okay. Oh, very good. Uh, Rajvi, this is uh, something very interesting and I know that this question comes mm -hmm. often, I mean, appears. Yeah. And uh, how many times do you think you would have uh, been asked this question? Uh, well, I remember the first time I was asked this question. Mm -hmm. um, it was when I was in year five, so I was just a year older than Bruno. Okay. Um, and so probably next year. Next probably year. Probably uh, children of Bruno's age, <coughs> maybe next maybe year, they'll be um, getting all those questions, right? Yeah. And they need to deal with them. For sure. Uh, it's important <coughs> that, um, you know, uh, when you're younger, you have an answer to that question. Um, so, so what was your answer when you were asked this? Well, my answer was what my dad had taught me. Mm -hmm. And that was to always flip the answer back onto the other person. And that's correct. And that that's also ends up being the correct answer as well. That's um, correct. Yeah. So have you ever been asked this? That what why question? do you, Yeah, I mean your friends, have they ever asked you that why do you um, not have short hairs? Something? Yes. They ask you? Yes. And what is your answer? Mm, I said that I have a r different religion than them okay. and they follow different things. Right. Mm. Hari, have you ever been asked this? Have your friends asked why do you wear this turban or patka? Yes. Hari, have you ever been asked that? Do your friends uh. ever ask you? Uh. Why you wear the star? Why you wear a bug? Do they ever ask you? Uh. No. 
No. Okay. No, not yet. Yeah, he's okay. too young for it. So, yeah. But you've been asked this, right? Yes. And then you said that this is because I follow a different religion. Yes. Now, um, how about if people will come to you and ask you that, um, why do you look different to us, right? Because this is the next question. Now you are being asked this question. This is going to be the next question. That uh, believing in a religion, still, why do you not cut your hair? Because that's what Guru Nanak Dev Ji and Guru Gobind Singh Ji told us. Brilliant, mm -hmm. brilliant. Uh, and this question, Sangha Ji, this, I know that this question is very, very uh, frequent question and very uh, a question that us children do deal with. Mm -hmm. So we are today going to seek an answer to this question. And I, I definitely agree to you that flip the question. Yeah. <gasps> do you know that uh, why Guru Nanak wanted you? What does flip you? the question mean? That's what I'm going to tell yeah, you. We're gonna explain so that. Um, do you know why Guru Nanak said I that you are not going to cut your hair? Um, because hair comes from God. Uh, exactly. Because this is, you are naturally, you know, God gives you this. And we don't correct God. Can we? Can we correct God? No. No, we cannot. And if we are cutting our hair, that means we are saying, Oh God, you have done something different, something wrong, so I need to correct it. And we don't do that. We, we are not. So whenever you, somebody asks you, why do you look different? You always try and say, no, I don't look different. I look natural. I look the way God has made me. Am I right in saying yeah. this? Mm -hmm. So what I would always say was, I don't look different. I look how we should look. Yes. Why do you look different? Yeah. <coughs> because by asking them that question, you instantly get the idea. They also understand that you actually know what you're talking about. So it's important that even if you don't always have all the answers, you sound confident in the answer you're giving. So that is always a good answer to give to anyone who asks you that question. Okay, Hari. What? So why do you look different? Do you look different? No. No, you look natural. Right? This is how yeah. God made us. Have God ever wanted you to cut your hair in the first instance he would have not given you the hairs no no he would have never given you hair so if he has given you hair that means he wanted you to keep them right yeah so you don't look different whenever somebody asks you why do you look different so you always answer we don't look different we look natural what will be your answer we look natural what will be your answer look natural. yes Good. we look the way god made us mm -hmm. Right? A long time ago, when I was three or four, mm -hmm. I used to cut my hair. But then I stopped when my daddy told me to. Mm. Oh, that's brilliant. That's good. That's good. Yeah. And how do you feel? Um, better. Better. And do you know why? Uh, because hair is natural. <laughs> Obviously, yeah. hair is natural. God has given you. You know, when you go to your class and your teacher gives you homework, um, have you ever done any, committed any kind of mistakes in your homework, Hari? Have, Have you, you ever made any mistakes? In yes, the yes, 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 yes. Yeah. yeah. And uh, what what is the reaction of your teacher? What what does she do to she correct that? She just tries to um, uh, make us understand what our subject is more. Mm -hmm. All right. And how does she point out that this is wrong? And she just underlines it in orange. Yep. And that means that that's wrong. And next time you're not supposed to commit that the same mistake. Is that right? Yes. So this is how we treat God, okay? God has made us the way we are. Your dad has a beard. Does your mother do? No, because girls don't have beards. That's so a silly question to ask. I, I, absolutely, it's obvious. absolutely. Now, if somebody, if somebody asks you that, um, see, your mother does not have a beard, but your dad ha does. That means this is a silly question. This hmm. is how she was made by God, right? And this is how God creates us. Now, if, if God ever wanted your mother to have beard, he would have given it, no? But he never wanted it, so she does not have. But your dad do, right? That, what does that mean? Because God wanted him to have the beard. Yes, it's because boys have beards and girls don't. Mm. So that's how gre God created. Now, if, if say your dad someday decides that, okay, I'm going to shave my beard, 
So he'll start looking as he your mother. He will never do that. Obviously he will never. But if he does, he will start looking like your mother. He won't because he's not a girl and he doesn't have the same hair color. He's not white like my mother as well. <laughs> <laughs> that's the physical appearance and that you are true. That that's very much true. Are you more informative than your teacher? Intelligent. Intelligent. Mm -hmm. Are you more are you smarter than your teacher? Not true. Not true. Yeah. So whatever your teacher Because the teacher teaches us Absolutely. so it's obvious <coughs> that we are not smarter. Ob obviously now if your teacher tells you that this is the in how do you how do you call it intelligence information no 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 the information suppose your teacher says that these words when you join them this makes this i don't know what is in other people when, you, when you create words and you join them into a sentence right yes yeah so if you have word so for example if i had the sentence the cat jumped over the fence right yes. Now, if I change that and said the fence jumped over the cat, would that make any sense? <laughs> no. <laughs> no? Right? Okay, now the question is that if you're all of your friends, they, they decide that they will be the way God made them, do you think that their hair will grow? If it, they, if they it will grow. Definitely. So why will they grow? Because that is how human body is made by God. Yes, her carry-ons uh, ca uh, carry on growing even when you are dead. Right. And same with your nails. Mm -hmm. And so, if, if you cut your hair, that means you are interfering in God's task. You are interfering in natural human body structure, right? And we don't do that. As a Sikh, we are ordered to obey the way God has created us. Does it make sense? Yes. Right? So that is why we don't look different. Next time, always say we look natural. What do you say, Hari? But actually, we it's true that um, some Sikhs look different to the others. How come? Um, I don't know. One could have a giant this star, one could have just a komado. One could have a round this star, one could have a domala. That's okay. That's 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 that, that, that makes that them different. No, 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 that doesn't make them different. For, in, for example, you are wearing this shirt. Yes. Right? And he's wearing jacket. Now, definitely, that's that's how you dress up. That's your attire that is different, and not your look. <sighs> now, if you are wearing shirt and the similar kind of shirt, if he also wears the same, or Rajvir also wears mm -hmm. the same, probably you will. Th th will that make you look same? No. Why? Because your appearance he, is. Because crazy. you could have different eyes, a different mouth. So that's that's your appearance, you know. When we say that we look different, that only means with your turban, all right? And the other other people who just cut their hair, but we have unshorn hair, that's it, all right? All of the differences which you spot now, that somebody wear long the star, short the star, that's only the attire that is different. That's not the appearance that's different, okay? All right? Yes. Thank you. Okay, so guys, in Pokemon, yes. yeah, there are certain gyms, correct? Yes. Each gym has their own mariada, right? Each gym has their own ideology. Yeah? Yes. Each gym has their own type. Yes. Right? Some are rock type gyms. Yes. Some are fire type gyms. Yes. Some are air type gyms. Yes. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Electric so, gym. Yeah, there's an electric gym. Okay. Right? So each gym has its own type of idea. Water type gyms. Right? But all gyms have one idea in common. And what is that? To train Pokemon. Exactly. Right? So, and why is that? Because Pokemon in the Pokemon world are natural. Yes. Yeah? Pokemon are around everywhere in the Pokemon world. Right? So, in the same way, when you come up with this ideology of not cutting your hair, if you were in the Pokemon world and said you weren't going to train a Pokemon, what's the point in you being there? No idea. Exactly. Right? Hari, if you were in the Pokemon world, which Pokemon would you have? Meltan. Okay, Meltan is a terrible Pokemon, but all right. What about you? No, it's a <laughs> Pikachu. Okay, you go for Pikachu, right? So <laughs> now, what? Now Pikachu looks naturally like a mouse, right? Yes, yeah. an electric yeah. type mouse. Yeah, and he has a thunder tail. Yes. Yeah. Now, if you got rid of that thunder tail, would he be able to use his electric attacks? Not really. No, right? So the idea is the way God has made you. He's made you th that way for a reason. Right? Whether it's in the fantasy world, whether it's in the anime world, whether it's in your natural human world, yeah, where Pokemon don't exist and the world's boring. 
right? So <laughs> it's important that wherever you live, whichever world you live in, you stay how God has created you. And you keep natural. How do you, where do you, how do you stay? Natural. natural. Good. Yeah. Okay. So next time, whenever somebody is asking you this question, why do you look different? What is our answer going to be? We are not wrong. We are not wrong. Your ans answer is going to be? We are, we are not, not different. No, we are not different. Mm -hmm. we, we are, are natural. natural. Speak again. Um, we are not different. We are natural. Hari? We are not different. We are natural. So, yes, this is the answer to the question that we are not, we does not, we do not look different. We look natural. This is how God made us. So, um, <laughs> Sangha ji, this uh, program, this episode, the end of which I will request that you all request that you all use your own language, which will be easily understood by your children. This question is the answer that you will keep your children. You will have to understand that when they ask this question, they will not be confused or confused. Or they will not depend on this thing. 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 कि असी वक्रे नहीं असी तो उम्मीद देखते हैं जिम्मे परमात्मा ने सानु बनाया सी तुसी दसो के तुसी वक्रे क्यों देते हो क्योंकि वक्रे वो देते हैं जो परमात्मा दी रजा तो बाहर चल रहे हैं असी वक्रे नहीं देखते इस तरह नेचुरल देखते हैं so Sangaji, thank you very much for watching. Uh, it is important and a, just a quick appeal to all the parents as well that are watching. Please ensure that in whatever language you can, explain to your children the importance of how to answer this question. If someone was to ask your child, if someone was to ask you, why do you look different? The best answer you can give is no, we do not look different. We look natural. We look exactly how God has made us. And those who cut their hair, those who change their appearance, they're the ones who look different. So why do you look different? It's always good to throw back the question and uh, reply to them in a question in that kind of manner to ensure that A, they understand that you know what you're talking <coughs> about and B, they also get the message as well. It's important that our children, our parents and anyone can answer these kind of questions. So, Sangha Ji, Tanwa Ji, Thwata Bob, Bob, Jinnani program dekhya. Yes, and probably we'll come up with new and other questions to be dealt with in another episode. Thank you for watching today. Thanks for watching episode 2. Thanks for watching episode 2. Wahe Guru Ji Ka Khalsa. Wahe Guru Ji Ka Khalsa. Wahe Guru Ji Ki Pate. Akal Channel Noo subscribe karo. Navi videos de notification de lehi bell icon noo click karna na pulna.